My name is Ruby, Ruby Kwan, and I work with Morrison Hirschfield as a bridge and structural engineer. For the role of the project, I was responsible for structural design for all the components, including the main galvanized steel beams. I'm Kent LaRose. Uh, I work at Morrison Hirschfield, senior bridge engineer. I was the engineer of record for the Capilano Cliff Walk. Well, the background behind the Capilano Cliff Walk is that it's used to get the visitors at Capilano uh, down onto the cliff face and provide a very unique experience, almost like you give them the experience of rock climbing without having to have the skill or the equipment. There was a number of components that was galvanized on the cliff walk. The main structural members, uh, HSS, the spiral steel staircase was hot dip galvanized and that was a duplex coating system that was painted afterwards. The Dewey Dag rock anchors were galvanized, the bolts were galvanized, um, cotter pins were galvanized, just about everything on the cliff walk was galvanized. There was approximately 50 tons of steel used in the project and just a touch over 40 was hot dip galvanized. Most of the structural components are steel and also in this uh, human rainforest uh, environment we want to have something that's more durable and easy to maintain so uh, galvanized became a very obvious choice. One of the main reasons we chose to galvanize is that we wanted our grandchildren's grandchildren to enjoy the park and this is definitely going to last more than a hundred years. When you, when you look around at the Capilano Suspension Bridge, uh, you look at their vision for their business model, sustainability is huge in it. Uh, in fact, one of the things that we were so concerned about sustainability uh, was that we included the David Suzuki Foundation in overlaying the educational component on the cliff walk. And because steel is one of the most recycled products on the planet and it's easy to protect it for a significant amount of time with a cost-effective hot dip galvanizing that has no maintenance, it was, became a very plain choice at the end of the day. If I could redesign and rebuild the Capilano Cliff Walk, we would definitely use hot dip galvanized steel. The only difference is I'd make it longer and wider and higher. That would be about it. But I think it's kind of pretty perfect the way it is.